A couple weeks ago, we listened to recommendations and tried a fish sandwich at Cafe Ole. After that video dropped, I got a couple invitations to other restaurants, which means that this is officially turning into a full-scale fish sandwich battle. But don't worry, my cousin and I are prepared to hit the streets and do the work. So today, we're heading to Granite's Kitchen on North Shore to try their fish sandwich and see who comes out on top. I cannot tell you how many times I've crossed Granite's in my life, but I've never been inside there before today. So in preparation for this visit, I did some research and found that the current owner took over in 2015. It's family owned and operated and specializes in Bermuda style home cooking. When we got there, it was pretty quiet, but some tourists had pulled up and we had a quick chat. I wanted to find out how did they even discover this place? You don't see many tourists in this area. All right, where are you guys from? Uh, we are from the States. Okay, um, how did you find Granny's or what made you come to Granny's of all places? We were looking for a fish sandwich. Uh, we tried Artnell's yesterday, but our cab driver last night told us that uh, that Artnell's doesn't use local fish and Granny says yeah. so, to come by. It's true, it's true. Okay, well thanks a lot. Thanks. Yeah. So the first thing you notice when you walk into Granite's is that it's very cozy, you yeah? know? It reminds me of being in my mom's kitchen when I was younger. Even had someone helping peel potatoes. So, what's that so you guys do all your potatoes by hand and everything? Yeah, and pots. Yeah. Now apparently they got some pretty bomb cuffish and potatoes here too. If you don't know, that's Bermuda's traditional Sunday breakfast, but we're not here for that. We're here for a fish sandwich. So my cousin here has volunteered to take the first bite. Let's open it up, see what we got. So this time we went with cheese, lettuce, tartar sauce, and hot sauce. That's what we were missing last time. Really nice presentation. I think the bread is homemade, I believe. And the tartar sauce was definitely homemade too, because it was very like relishy. So I'm not gonna lie, it wasn't my favorite fish sandwich of all time, but it was okay. It was okay. It was just a different texture than I was used to. And then I called to find out what type of fish they used because it was quite dark and turns out it was uh, amberjack. Now, I'm not an amberjack fan usually, but the way they prepared this, it was a lot better than I'm used to. So while I wouldn't say it's my favorite fish sandwich, I will say that it's a good option. Especially if you're looking for a local establishment with a real Bermuda feel to it. You know, you can go in, speak to real Bermudians that are there preparing the food right in front of you. It's a great spot. Definitely check them out if you have a chance. But the battle continues. Ain't that right, Tsunami? <laughs> 